Hello Manjaro community, this is Dorian. Here's what's new in Manjaro XFCE 18.0. The wonderful welcome screen adds an applications button to make it easy to install some commonly used packages, like web browsers. Simply check the boxes and click on Update System. This is an example of the new features in the updated PAMAC package manager. This along with many new features like command line options have been covered in detail by Philip, the Manjaro project leader, and you can find a link to that video in the description below. 18.0 includes some wonderful theming by the Manjaro team that takes advantage of the Quantum engine. This engine ensures that the themes will match nicely with all Qt applications. This gives you a nice consistent theme experience across any application that you want to use. On EFI systems, the new Grub now shows an image of the manufacturer's logo during boot instead of showing the system D text. In this case, I'm using VirtualBox, which of course displays the VirtualBox logo. If, for example, you're running an MSI system, then you'll see the MSI logo. Manjaro is now using components from XFCE 4.13, which includes a new display manager. This display manager includes profiles, which will now allow you to save your settings, and it will remember them the next time you plug in that display. Other updates include the new kernel of 4.19 being used, as well as the NVIDIA 410 series of drivers. As always, the easy-to-use hardware configuration in the Manjaro settings allows you to auto-detect and install open-source or proprietary drivers, and also allows you to use Optimus-enabled GPUs via Bumblebee. This way, your system will normally run on the energy-efficient Intel GPU and switch to the NVIDIA GPU when required. Manjaro has a wonderful software package selection available in the repos of current and up-to-date versions of all software including LibreOffice, VLC, Chromium, Firefox, Blender, GIMP, Krita, and even has Steam installed by default, and it works perfectly. Give it a try by heading over to manjaro.org, click on Downloads, Current Releases, and pick your flavor. The Manjaro XFCE edition is the very first one. If you've already installed Manjaro, there's no need to re-download. Simply perform all your system updates and you'll be brought up to version 18.0. If you've never tried it before, go ahead and download it. Give it a shot in a virtual machine and I'm sure you'll be very pleased. That's all for now. Stay tuned for announcements on current and upcoming releases as new features are being added all the time. Thanks for watching and until next time, enjoy the simplicity.